将要进行的是男子负六十八公斤级的决赛。Now it's the coach at the back of Ms. Minus sixty eight kilograms. So as you can see on the board there, we have the brackets. Resulting in this gold medal contest between the men's <laughs> minus 68 division. <laughs> Shuejo, Olympic and world champion, versus Lee Dae Hung, Olympic medalist, three times world champion from Korea. Should be an exciting matchup. Andrew Building, Shua J from China, Olympic champion, coming into the building. Looking focused and ready. Now entering three times world champion in Rio, 2016 Olympic bronze medalist, Daehun Lee from Korea. Taking a breath there. This is third Grand Slam. In 2018 he won a bronze medal. 2017 he won a gold medal. Can he do better than he did last year? He's already qualified for Tokyo. 2020 Olympic Games next year. So now it's about to win this event for the second time. Bring home some cash money. Shuei looking very good, looking focused on home soil. Here we go. His back leg from Daehyung Lee of Korea in red. Sui Cho from China in blue on home soil looking to win the prize of WT Grand Slam Champion 2019. Again, this round or match off will be best of five rounds.
Lots of different exchanges, but not quite finding the point. Back kick spin. Open it up with the first scoring shot. Down Lee. Just looking to get this job done in, in less in more than in less than four rounds. Wins three rounds out of five is one. Two rounds out of five is one. Tie up there. Just to keep it controlled in that gap. Oh. So China holding the hugu of a red player there. Oh. To all. Trey just getting the point underneath that there. Turn into a fight now. Ended up a draw. All to play for. Going into round two. This is the men's minus 68 gold medal contest if you've just joined us. We've got two exciting athletes. Former three times world champion against the current Olympic champion from China. we go to the second round. Both men trying to gauge each other. thousand dollars on the line. Oh, great exchange there. They only being rewarded. Very tight here, 40 seconds remaining. Men's final. 
30 seconds. Two punches have scored. Several successful registrations, but not meeting the threshold. Oh, back kick attempt from Joe. Oh, another one. We should bring it back. Good work there. That was a very good tactical round. Very closed, cagey. A lot of manipulation in the in that distance, ready to expose and exploit their opponent. So there we have it. So joining us here, we have Martin Stamper, Great Britain national coach, high performance coach here, just coming in with an expert eye on this minus 68 division fight. Um, you've got two of the best players here, obviously Zhao, uh, Olympic champion in the minus 58 division, done really well this year. Uh, and Lido and the legend. Lido is a very technical fighter. Brilliant back legs, brilliant setups. And Xiao, more tactical. They've had some great fights this year. Xiao got the better him in the final of uh, Sofia. I think it was quite comfortable in the end, 19-9 maybe. So I think Dayun's going to step up here looking to avenge that loss. A grudge match, is it? Less than one minute 30 to go. Career currently leading in the third round of five. So Zhao's very good, just managing the match, looking to tie up and steal a round. Nice stab, nice stab. Turn up to the red. That's a 4 nil. Nice follow up there, just was unsuccessful with the high attempt. Dayun Lee keeping him on the back foot, being relentless there with the pressure. Zhao comes back with a high shot. Yeah, Zhao needs to find something at the end of this round or he'll be going into the last round with a lot of pressure on him. Nice stab. 30 seconds left. Zhao up the pace a little bit. So composed, Lee Do Yun. Still 4 0, 15 seconds. Shao maybe trying to set up a spin. Yep, oh, nearly. Three seconds to go. And that's that round done. And that's two rounds to Daehun Lee in this WT Grand Slam final. So, Martin, how do you think that round went? Yeah, I think Shao was playing it very, very tactically, like trying to st like induce Lee Daehun to come, uh, cover his shots, and, and like find that one shot and then control the match. And uh, I think uh, Lee Daehun knows that, so he's he's playing a lot more like. 
a, a, probably a lot of slower pace than he would normally, um, just not to open his body up too much. And that's why the last two rounds are being 4-0, you know, where he's controlled, it, Lee Dayun's almost controlled it on him. Um, and there's a lot of pressure on Zhao now, um, going into this fourth round, because if he doesn't win, then it's over. Even a draw, and it's done. First round the draw, and then Lee Dayun, Lee Dayun, so he needs to win this round or it's done. Can Lee Dayun keep this momentum and, and bring it home? Uh... I think so. Well, we'll see. Zhao's, like I said, Zhao's, uh, you can't rule him out, but um, it's going to be tough for him. This is a repeat of the first uh, Grand Slam final as well. 2017, they fought each other in the final. Okay. Um, that was a, a masterclass by Lee Dayun, I think. Uh, it was a 30 point gap or something. It was a ridiculous fight. Zhao's third, third final on the run, so that's how consistent he's been. Now he's went silver, gold, and then he's trying to fight for gold again now. 2-0 to Dayun, good go back leg. And a gam jump for Zhao. And 3-0, more pressure on Zhao. Another strong stab there. Yeah, Lee Dayun doing very well controlling the distance. He's been enjoying that bat leg all day high. Been successful sometimes. He's playing for time there. And again, trying to force the Gamjun for for blue, not fighting. Yeah, I think he's just trying to keep the pressure on. He's just trying to give Zhao like uh, no space, or if he gives him space, he's making a miss just to frustrate him, like exactly like that. His movements, yeah, his movements ridiculous. When he's on it, he's brilliant. Very yeah, nice. Dayun Lee been making people miss all day, all day. Really has been a masterclass in movement. You'll enjoy that, won't you? <laughs> It's key to everything, wasn't it? 40 seconds left. Boy, good try, good try. That's what Zhao's so dangerous with that back kick. Late on in matches, as I know too well. Not me personally, but my players. <laughs> <laughs> nice twist attempt from Zhao. Yeah, he really needs to find something now or this match is done. Oh, that back kick again. Shui Zhao. Attempting the back kick, one of his top techniques. Leader home with his typical back leg oh, with a nice stab it. to show dominance. Yep, it's done. Five seconds has Zhao given up. Where's the fighting spirit? And there it is. Dae Hun Ling being declared 2019 WT Grand Slam Champion in the minus 68 division. What fantastic all day. How do you think that went? Um, yeah. Leader just said, yeah, give me the money as he's just <laughs> walked away with $70,000 for the second time. So he's going to have a good Christmas. Um, I think Xiao tried to play uh, like play the game very tactical and stay on the back foot and li let Lee Dayun do all the work but this guy can adapt really well like so I think Lee Dayun almost played him at his own game and and, and, and kind of didn't go too aggressive which he's done to uh, done so before when people are on the back foot and kind of yeah it was a it was a tight it was tight every round but Lee Dayun was quite comfortable as you see there like 2-2 4-0 4-0 5-0 I, I just don't. Th I think sometimes Zhao was a little bit unlucky on the system. I, I don't think the system's been very good here. Like it's been very inconsistent, which is not not good enough for me. But um, great players adapt, and that's what Lee Dayun's done. You know, and Zhao couldn't 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 do that to get the win. There's more than one way to win a taekwondo match, isn't there? Yeah, and it's it's it is. 
unfortunately it is our sport sometimes you know w things that we can't control um, have an effect on the match and you've just got to stay composed it's another side to the game being mentally very strong you know so that's why he's he's three time world champion and done what he's done because that is a strength of his is that, that composure no matter what's happening in the match he can stay composed and uh, he goes home with another $70,000 I'm looking forward to this next match. Um, so we've got 